He's decisive once he stands over the ball and is ready to hit. It's about committing to the sh shot shape. He's going to take it off that bunker with a little peeler to the from left to right. Exactly what he did. Pretty low. This should chase out. Really well done there, Paige. Getting a cut into the wind. You really have to keep speed up. Tugged it just a little. A yeah. little deep. Tough two putt, but wow. safely on. Yeah, that is going to be, a, we've seen plenty of three putt from this distance. With a hard right to left break. Fred Biondi of Florida is two putts away from winning the individual championship, but it won't be easy. Left shot here. I learned from my mentor, Ken Venturi, coming down the stretch. You got your adrenaline going. You want to hit something hard. Uh, you've been flushing it all day. There's really no reason to think that you wouldn't flush this next one. So right, perhaps a little tactical error, but we'll see if I can get this down in two and become the individual champion. Don't take much time over it. That's going to be low. Pretty good speed, though. Pretty well judged by Fred Biondi. So he will have that for par and to win the individual title. Been really textbook for most of the day. What's the read on this putt, Paige? I don't see a ton of movement. If anything, it's going to fall to the left. Has to keep some speed up. Most certainly. He has had a tendency to hit the back of the cup on these putts. He's been very assertive with his putt and his short putting today. The senior from Brazil has this putt, Fred Biondi, of the University of Florida, to win the individual national championship. And Biondi with the par at 18. And Fred Biondi has won the 2023 Men's NCAA Individual Championship. It's a great honor, well deserved. Friends, Tom Kite, Justin Leonard, Bryson DeChambeau. <laughs> Winning is fun, you can tell. I should have a blaster. Let's go, baby. 